guys what is up welcome back to my youtube channel um i am absolutely exhausted i only have two more days until christmas break a couple weeks ago i finally put on my to-do list like buy christmas gifts for people and you know what it's december 15th so i realized that i'm cutting it extremely close and i need to be ordering tonight if i want any chance of it coming before christmas that's what we're gonna be doing today i am exhausted my head hurts and like just this ring light hitting my face is definitely not helping so i'm sorry if my energy like seems kind of out of it i really want to take a nap but we have priorities ladies and gents we need to be ordering everyone's christmas gifts so let's do that okay my desk is kind of a mess let me just like clear that off really quick um anyways so i have the notes page up on my phone and we're just gonna like start figuring out and brainstorming what i want to get for gifts usually i just go with like a safe thing and i straight up ask people what they want i know i'm that person i hate me too but like I just don't know what to get people and I just hate getting people stuff that they don't like. <sighs> Anyways, okay, let's figure this out. Okay, I think for one of my friends, I'm gonna get like a Carhartt beanie just because I feel like it's a really good staple and I don't think she has one. There's so many colors to choose from. Bro, how am I supposed to decide? All together forever be you can obviously tell that it's a lot later. Um, my hair's wet. I just took a bath. It was so relaxing. I found all of the stuff that I want to get people. I just had to go and transfer money from my savings account to my checking account on my debit card. Oh my goodness. LOL. I finally just like ordered all of the gifts that I'm getting for people and um... <laughs> I guess I didn't realize like how much money I was spending until I added all of it up. What is that? I was not planning on spending that much. If you didn't know me, I stress out a lot over spending money. Like it's something I always think about, but I just need to like remember that like these are for friends and family that I love and it's how I can show my appreciation or one of the ways. I'll catch up with you guys when they start showing up in the mail. I'm so excited. Good morning, good morning, good morning. It's December 21, so four more days until Christmas. And some of the stuff came in the mail, so I'm gonna start wrapping it. Low key, this gift I'm the most excited for. Basically how I decided to get it was we were sitting in am lit class and i was just like scrolling through my instagram and then i scrolled to this picture and my friend that was sitting beside me was like oh my goodness i love that sweater and i was like i know right so cute and i tried to hunt down this sweater like i found this sweater and it is so cute oh christmas tree oh christmas tree i'm literally using kid scissors Okay, if you couldn't tell, I'm extremely bad at wrapping. Hopefully we'll get better at this video goes on. So I got this gift for another friend and it's like that super trendy like sunset lamp. Hopefully she hasn't already bought one for herself or she didn't like ask it for Christmas from her parents. I think she's really gonna love it. So I need to get some gift bags and this is where we store all of them. Honestly, that's such good organization, love that. And this drawer is where we keep all of the gift tags. My family like reuses the tags, so these tags are like from years ago that we just like slap on the presents again. These stickers will work for what I'm wanting to use them for. This gift is for another one of my friends and it's basically like a USB book light and I'm also gonna head to the store sometime this week and get her like a Twix candy bar because that's her favorite candy just to like add to the gift. The last present that's like come in the mail so far, I, I have this Carhartt beanie that I'm giving a friend. I ended up going with black. There were so many color options. I just ended up getting black. My sister's here, my cousins too. My brother's flew in this Much better. Okay, so before we get into the really cute montage of all my friends and family opening their gifts, which by the way, you're definitely gonna wanna stay for that. It's adorable. But anyways, I wanna talk about today's sponsor. I'm very happy to tell you that this video is sponsored by Dossier. If you didn't know, Dossier is a perfume company that has really high-end and luxury scents at like a fraction of the price. Cause I don't know about you, I'm not about to spend like $200 on a perfume. Like that just doesn't make sense to me. I do not have money for that. The fact that you can get like a 50 milliliter, like a pretty good 
good size bottle of perfume for like only around 30 bucks is really cool to me also the coolest thing about these perfumes a lot of them are inspired by like a designer perfumes because you know those perfumes that cost like $200 Dossier makes like pretty much the same quality of perfume and like the comparison is so good I got sent two perfumes by Dossier to try out for myself first one was Florental Vanilla and then the second one was Citrus Ginger just the packaging alone like the caps are magnets to each other which like I know that's like the tiniest detail but I just love it so much and I know what you're thinking I mean maybe you're not thinking this but this is definitely what I was thinking is like okay why would I buy perfumes online because number one how do you know that their perfumes smell good you know like that's such a weird thing that you can't really order online because you're like oh my goodness what's the actual scent but that's not really a problem with dossier because each bottle comes with like a really small sample so you can like test out the scent for yourself and see if you like it before you unseal the 50 milliliter uh, perfume and if you don't like the scent like that's completely fine and normal like I feel like not everyone is gonna like every single scent it's just really easy you just send back the unsealed 50 milliliter bottle and then you get a full refund no questions asked and not to flex or any Thing, but the Florental Vanilla is now like my signature scent. I wear it every single day and I've been getting more compliments that like, oh, you smell good in the past month with wearing this perfume than I have in my entire life. And if that doesn't say something, I don't know what will. I love this perfume. I think it smells so good. And just go check out Dossier for yourself because they have a ton of scents. Anyways, thank you Dossier for sponsoring this video and back to the video. Bruh, I don't even fit. Is it going? Yeah. Oh, put that in. Okay. I'm opening it. I've never had one of these. I can't figure out how to do it. I don't cross my mind. She doesn't know that your face is Brandy Shorts. No. No, no, no. I take the long way home. Avoid what I can. Always think about you, but sometimes I do. Cause sometimes I try. What's that look like? That's cool. All I like of it. the streets we used to. Oh, I'm first ever new. Cause sometimes oh, I find you. Know <laughs> first, all of the turns that I oh, had to my life. To the safest, the feeling of all the way. So cute. Look at her go. <laughs> okay, guys, that's it for the video. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you have such a very like merry Christmas. and subscribe. Subscribe. Follow the Instagram. Oh, All you. that jazz. Oh, okay. Have a good one. Adios, amigos. Bye. <laughs>